and buildings. Good morning to you. We are here at Union Buildings where thousands of ANC Women's League supporters are gathered here to come and uh, you know, uh, conduct the prayer service for the, uh, for the upcoming elections. I'm standing next to me here with uh, the Deputy President of the Women's League, Mrs. Uh, Sisin Tombela. Welcome to, to SABC. Miran. No, thank you very much. I'm here. Can you tell us about this event? Yo, you know, this event is a very important and a very special event. You must remember this democracy of us. We did not just get it. We fought for it. And we still have people, we have people who have died for it. So we are here to come and talk to our God. We are here to come and pray and say, please God, we must protect, help us to protect this democracy. You must remember God has been with us before. He is still with us and he's still going to be with us. So the first thing that we're going to do, we're going to talk to God to please, please, our democracy must be safe. Secondly, we are here to pray for peace. We are going for the elections. We don't want any war. We are not interested in any war. We are going to talk to our God to say, God, please, August month, let's have a peaceful, a peaceful, a peaceful elections. We don't want to see our people bashwile. That is why we are here. The third thing, we are here as women, women from churches, women from societies, women from all over. You can see they are here just to come and endorse the manifesto of the African National Congress to say, ANC, we are with you. We are going to work very hard to make sure that everything is on my hand. Sure. I see thousands of red galati. Are you, still, are you still expecting more? You know, I'm shocked. In fact, I'm surprised. You know, I get we expected only 10 to 15,000 people. You can see for yourself, already 45,000 45, people are here and others are still coming. They are marching. God is great. It shows that God is with us. Amen. Amen. Are, you, are you expecting the president to come and receive your memorandum of support? We are, the president is going to give us a message. At the moment, we are not sure whether he will be here. But I know that we are going to have a message from the president. Because the other thing that we are praying for is what is happening in parliament. We don't want to see what is happening in parliament as black people. It is really bad. It is sad. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. because what is happening in parliament as black people now, we are busy insulting each other. We are busy criticizing each other. Mm -hmm. As if we have even taught our children a di how to disrepair the elderly. So we are also going to pray very hard Mudimwaka, Banabarona, they must learn how to respect because yes. respect is the most important thing if you want to be something. Yes. Tell me, as the NC Women's League, what is your, do you have any concerns with uh, the current, uh, you know, violence which is, uh, which has, uh, which is bedeviling uh, Limpopo province? Very worried. You must remember, Hori, women were not allowed to be educated. You must remember, Hori, we are now pushing for young women to be educated. We are pushing for young women to make education first number. So if people have been in the schools, they don't, they don't have an idea where do we come from. We are really worried. We can't allow that people must come and destroy, especially schools, because we are, without education, we are nothing. We are very worried and we are very concerned and we are going to visit Lipopo as soon as possible. And the other thing that, you know, that worries us, you know, for my manner to say to the president, Zuma. You know, for a, a young black boy, young black boy, he called himself a priest, a priest. He's saying to President Zuma, Fuzek President Jacob Zuma. You know what? He must know. He must know wherever he is. He has done a, a grievous mistake. You can't insult Mutamu Hulu and Nawanaga. I'm sure even your mother is very disappointed of what you have done. Yes. Tell me your message to, to, to other women and, and generals, you know, public out there with regard to these coming elections. I just want to talk to women. You know where do we come from as women. I can't explain for you. I can't tell you. You know exactly. Yes. We were not even allowed to have houses. We were not allowed. Because if you're not married, no side told him to. But today, so I just want them to do the right thing. Please save the African National Congress. Please, with the power that we have as women, 
protect the African National Congress. Let us stop fighting amongst ourselves. In the Lendlela Esihamba. Thank you. Thank you so much, man. Thank you for your time. Bye. Thank you, studio. Back to you.